All right, I've got a little trick for you if you guys are struggling with doing a single leg squat is to use a slider. Now these things are used quite a bit in physio and in rehab in the sports community, but they're really, really good to try and control your single leg squat if you're struggling. So what I mean is, if you are having a problem with a single leg squat, meaning when you squat down, you're struggling with the control. Like you can't weight bear properly on that leg and you want to put the other leg down, like when you do a lunge, then what I suggest you do is use these without a step. So you need to be on a slidey surface, so something like this, so uh, some lino or floorboard where you've got some slipperiness there, and one foot on something that's solid that's not gonna move. Now, when you do this exercise, what I want you to use the slider for is to make sure that you don't weight bear back on it. The slider is to simply keep your foot in contact with the ground. So what I mean is, when you do a single leg squat, I want you to try and keep the weight over the front leg, not put weight through the back leg. So this is not designed for this purpose to do a sliding lunge where my weight is here. Okay, it's not to do a dynamic lunge like that. This is to try and perfect a single leg squat. So when you slide, this is the hard part, is you've got to keep weight off this. Okay, there's a little bit of weight there for stability, but you're trying to keep this very light so it slides, and you squat down and stay weight bearing over that single leg. So this is hardly doing anything. So when you come up, you have to come up with this leg here, which is actually a little bit harder strength-wise than that, but it's easier control-wise. So like I said, it's really good for people who are struggling. If you're this sort of person, when you go into a squat and you sort of roll in, okay, or you get to the point where you're, you're sort of about to collapse and you want to put weight through there, or when you squat, you sort of always put weight down, this is a good way of trying to perfect that and get some confidence and some strength in that front leg. So when you, like I said before, when you come onto this position here, keep your weight down through that heel. So when you load backwards, this is just simply sliding back, bit of confidence and contact. And this way you can actually see, am I keeping my knee in line? Am I keeping my foot straight through here? Okay, and then when I come back up, don't, don't drag the foot, okay? Don't use this leg to come up, use your front leg. So when I'm coming down, you're gonna have to then pause, don't go too deep, and then push up through that front leg, which is gonna give you the more strength. So there's today's tip.